Since the dawn of time, stars have been lighting our way. The first man looked up to the stars to chart his path forward. He built civilizations, factories and ships to reach the stars. But at what cost? The World Bank estimates that the amount of gas escaping oil and gas companies a year, known as gas flaring, releases 400 million tons of harmful greenhouse gases into the atmosphere, costing around 16 billion US dollars in lost revenue and irreparable damage to the environment. Oman flares around 2.5 billion cubic meters of gas annually, which is enough to cover a considerable amount of the gas demand for power generation. But it's never too late to make things right. In 2017, Oman endorsed the World Bank Zero Routine Flaring by 2030 initiative and sets its targets to reach it by 2027. At Dalil, we are committed to our country's mission, the planet's future, and to our children's right to see the stars. In early 2023, Dalil has achieved zero routine flaring, seven years ahead of the World Bank's target. Dalil was flaring all the produced associated gas until 2008, when the first gas processing train was commissioned to extract valuable liquids such as LPG and NGL that resulted in 28% total flare reduction. In 2012, Dalil commissioned the power plant to generate the required field power demand, utilizing gas as fuel and significantly reducing diesel consumption. In 2018, the second gas processing train was commissioned to maximize the extraction of LPG and NGL and export the surplus gas, which resulted in 80% reduction in total flared gas. In early 2023, Zero routine flaring was successfully achieved by further eliminating all atmospheric pressure flaring. By achieving zero routine flaring, Dalil has recovered 440,000 tons of LPG, 2.8 million barrels of NGL, and exported 28 billion standard cubic feet of lean gas. In addition to these impressive figures, Dalil has also made significant progress in reducing its carbon footprint dropping diesel consumption for power generation from 32 cubic meters per day in 2012 to 0.3 cubic meters per day in 2023. But we are not stopping here. We have big plans for the future, such as reducing non-routine flaring, less fuel gas consumption, better safety flaring requirements, improving energy efficiency, and utilizing more renewable energy sources. Dalil Petroleum, Zero Routine Flaring.